where spirituality meets hospitality. Anjum Hotel, Mecca. Upon arrival, I was captivated by the uniquely embracing and warm welcome of Anjum Hotel Mecca. The Hijazi culture was clearly projected in the facade of the hotel. I was happy to see how the buses could conveniently drop us off right at the doorstep of the hotel. I was humbled by his welcome, a hand to the heart symbolizing expressing his passion. The lobby is vast, yet warm, and from the moment I entered, I felt at home. The staff members were always smiling and always at hand to assist me in every way. Within moments, I was checked in and was being guided to my room. Along the way, I was impressed by the number of elevators available, which made me realize how easy it will be to leave the room to the Holy Haram during prayer times for guests of the well-appointed 1,743 rooms and suites. As the door to my room opened, I realized I was in for a truly luxurious experience. From warm lighting and colors, to comfortable furniture and amenities. The smallest of details had been taken into consideration. I felt the spiritual connection at the window, where I had a clear and direct view of the Holy Haram. The dining experience caters to different types of cuisine at every meal. I embarked on a culinary journey, from restaurants that seat up to 3,500 guests, to lounges, snack bars, cafes, and in-room dining. Anjum Hotel Mecca provided me with a variety of tastes and flavors 24 hours a day. Anjum Hotel Mecca's physical location at the doorstep of the Holy Haram and direct access to the Holy Haram via an air-conditioned private access made it extremely convenient and quick for me to access the grandeur of the new King Abdullah Gate. In the evenings, again, I had a unique Anjum experience as the only hotel in Mecca with an outdoor piazza and fountains. It was the perfect setting to unwind and reflect upon the spiritual journey. My stay at Anjum Hotel made my spiritual journey to Mecca complete. It is truly Mecca's second most important destination. Uh, waktu dari Hotel Anjum, Anjum, ke Masjidil Haram. Sekarang jam 4.40. Ya, kita mulai ya. Ini rutenya nih, jalannya nih. Ini, ini melewati eskalator turun. Kita tinggalnya di Tower 2. 
tower 1 sama tower 2 di lantai 2 ada connecting bridge-nya jadi sama aja liftnya mau dari lantai 1 atau dari tower 1 atau, atau tower 2 setelah turun turun dari eskalator jadi eskalatornya sebelah situ ini ada ruangan besar oh iya ini basement ada di sini ada satu mesin ATM SABB Uh, kita menuju keluar dari basement nah dari keluar basement ini sudah kelihatan Masjidil Haram towernya dan itu adalah tower jam jam jadi di depan ini langsung jalan besar Uh, ini terlihat situasi sebelum subuh Sekarang jam 4.42 uh, Waktu subuhnya jam 5 lebih lewat 8 menit Nah ini ini adalah bangunan baru dari luasan dari Masjidil Haram Banyak banget orang yang Inilah suasana di dalam Masjidil Haram. Kita sekarang lagi berjalan terus ke ujung mendekati ke apa? Oh ya, kita sekarang sudah jam ini jam 4.53. Jadi berapa menit Mas? 13 menit. Jadi sekitar 13 menit dari 10 sampai 13 menit dari uh, Hotel Anjum ke Masjidil Haram. Ini perjalanan dari Masjidil Haram ke Anjum Hotel. Dia hotelnya sebelah sana. Itu memakan waktu 13 menit Kurang lebih Kalau jalannya santai Kalau jalannya cepat mungkin bisa 10 me, eh, 9 menit lah 10 menit nah, Ini pintu masuk Anjum Hotel Kita sekarang menuju ke Tower 2 Oh di sini juga ada satu lagi ATM lah lebih dekat ada satu ATM di dekatnya Tower 2 ini uh, semacam lobbynya lobby daerah uh, bagian luar ini Tower 1 Ya nur al-hilal Aqbil ta'al Fashyawq ta'al Wal-qalbu sama Nahwa sama Mutarannima La la tanqadi Anta lil-ruhi dawa Ramadhan Amal 